So hello and welcome here to a new video and today we're going to talk about the ZK Sync AdWorp and all the other AdWorps regarding the ZK Sync Tasknet. Obviously, if that sounds interesting, I suggest you should leave a like, comment and subscribe because that helps out the channel quite a lot. Make sure to join the Discord as well as Telegram, link for those in the description down below. And with AdWorps, we already know the Optimism AdWorp, if you did all the steps, was worth around 50k at the peak. And with that being said, let's look into the next potential huge AdWorp that will come out, which is called ZK Sync. And basically what you need to do first is actually get the testnet into your MetaMask. And how can you do that? Well, you visit Chainlist, you put on the testnets, and then you search for the ZK Sync Alpha Testnet. And you simply press on Add to MetaMask. And after that, you will see it in your MetaMask over here. Then you are ready already to connect to the website. We now move over onto the girly faucet, which is the step one to do. So you create basically an account over here, put in your wallet and press on send fever. Then you will receive 0.1 ETH every 24 hour. And that pretty much is what I recommend doing. Do it every day, get as much free Ethereum as you can. And then you can use that on the Zeek Sync network. And how to do that, we will see in the further steps. Next thing you need to do is go on to the ZK Sync website. All the links, by the way, regarding those sites are in the description down below. You can now come and request funds from the faucet. You just press over here. You will then tweet that out. After that, you even can delete the tweet and yeah, just don't let it up there but i would simply let it up to inform other people that you can simply get it for free over here and with that you have the both free adwords uh, on the testnet and you can head over and do the first thing which i recommend doing is bridging over your ethereum onto the zk sync testnet and how you do that it's very easy you connect your wallet onto the site you put in the maximum amount that you want to bridge over you hit deposit, you confirm, and after that, you simply wait. You need to also enable the other test nets in your MetaMask. How you do that is you go on to the uh, settings, and then you go on to advanced, and you scroll down, and you will see an option, show test nets. Put that on, on. After that, you are ready to connect to the girly test net, where you will receive the 0.1 ETH. After you are connected to this testnet, you can bridge it over. And if it's bridged over, you are ready to explore the ecosystem of the ZK Sync testnet. And the first step I would definitely su suggest doing is visiting 1KX, which is an exchange plus a collateralized loan platform. Here I already have done a few swaps regarding um, Ethereum, regarding Chainlink. If you want to do that, you can simply head over onto this one and swap your funds and even supply your own. We already supplied a bit of Ethereum. We already took out the loan versus Chainlink, which is very easy. You head on borrow, you put the asset in that you want to borrow against for us. That would be Ethereum. You put in how much you want, you will see, okay, we can take a limit out of three chain link if you have the limit you hit on borrow and then they will be in your wallet and you simply can repay it whenever you want on don't even bother with it because it's the test net and that is one thing that i definitely recommend doing because they already have confirmed that there will be an airdrop regarding this over here next thing mint square which is an nft marketplace where you can buy trade sell whatever nfts even mint your own one and minting your own one is definitely the best thing to do it's very easy you head over onto mint you drop in your image over here you name it and you put everything on press on mint confirm the transaction and it is in your wallet then you head over onto the profile and you can visit your nft that is an additional loop step the next thing which is the space uh, fi swap slash farm which currently sadly is not working because of the genesis problem that they have um, visit the discord to be up to date what is going on there but obviously this is the classic yield farming 
where you put your money in, where you earn LP uh, regarding tokens, for example, the star and ETH one, the star token being their own, which also will be airdrop later on, which is already confirmed that they will do an airdrop, and also head over onto the swap where you then can perform ETH versus Chainlink or whatever. Again, it is not working because of the problems mentioned earlier regarding the genesis. And that is something that you need to look out for. Join that Discord as well, then you are up to date when it is working again. And basically, go ahead, supply, pool, and swap. And then you are basically in for the adwop as well. Then we also have Fazan protocol, which is not working as well because, again, the same problems as mentioned below, uh, as mentioned below, as mentioned earlier because of the Genesis block. And this is one of the one which also has confirmed that they are going to release a token. So most likely if you do the swaps over here, supply liquidity, short and longer position, you are eligible for adverbs here as well too. And the next thing that you need to do, which I also recommend doing, which you already did 10 months ago in a video, is bridging your ETH over using it on the layer 2 and you can see what we did back then only a bit of ETH but I think at least doing one transaction should be enough we even did a swap and that is pretty much what you should do as well and here you can simply top up and transfer that over onto your layer 2 and you can see what we currently got ETH and USDT that's pretty much what we have it's not much it's not really needed that we have a lot it is only that you use the stuff that is out there. Same as all the other ones. You don't need to have a lot of money in it. But what counts is, I think, the transaction that you do and a bit the volume, depending on the protocol you are using. But because it's a test net, you can receive an unlimited amount of money and basically do an unlimited amount of swaps because you don't care about the gas fees and getting some money for free is definitely something that you should be considering uh, doing in the bear market and yeah that's pretty much <coughs> one of the biggest airdrops I guess that comes out this year uh, in around eight days so pretty much that's it on all the steps that you can do there are some more out there obviously I'm not going to showcase all of them because there's just way too many but we will do in the near future maybe an update on the ZK Sync airdrops and what we received and hopefully what you guys received and that's pretty much it for today hope you enjoyed make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and then we see us in tomorrow's video i don't know what that will be about but yeah bye bye